There are many interpretations to this DC classic, the Ricky. This is a drink that you can enjoy real fast. It's almost like drinking, almost drinking like a lemonade um, with, with booze. I'd say in the same family, you're gonna have the Collins, the Gimlet. If you're not used to it, it's gonna be kind of sour, but it is refreshing. It's a nice summer drink. Even though the Ricky today is mostly associated with gin, it was first made with bourbon. We'll start off by showing you how to make the traditional bourbon Ricky. After that, we'll show you how to make one of my favorite contemporary twists, the Autumn Ricky. For a classic Ricky, you'll need a lime, some mineral water, and a good quality bourbon. Today, we're using Larceny. The traditional Ricky is a very simple cocktail. We're just gonna hand crack some ice and drop that into a highball glass. And then we'll hand squeeze a half of a lime over the ice and drop it in. Follow that with an ounce and a half of bourbon and top it off with some mineral water. Give it a little stir to mix and enjoy. For the autumn rookie, we'll still need some lime and some bourbon, but we'll be using soda water instead of mineral water. And we'll also need some grade B maple syrup. We'll start off by adding ice to a highball glass. Next, we're gonna put in some lime wheels so they layer in the cocktail. Then I'll pour in a half ounce of maple syrup. Grade B is not gonna be so refined, so it adds a nice richness and depth and texture to the cocktail and does pretty well with a high acid like lime. Next, I will add an ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. Then we'll add an ounce and a half of bourbon and finish off with some club soda. We wanna get rid of that settling maple syrup and lime at the bottom, so you wanna give it a good stir. And we're done. The Autumn Ricky is gonna be a little softer and a little more approachable, perfect for an autumn day. But classic or contemporary, you can never go wrong with a good Ricky.